Tonight, the Target 12 investigators have new details on a story we broke first on WPRI.com. House Speaker Nick Mattiello has discussed a purported bullying incident involving state representative and a woman who testified against the bill the rep sponsored. Another hearing on the measure is underway right now. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau tells us what he's uncovered. Walt. The bill in the middle of this dispute would eliminate licensing requirements for people who are paid to braid hair, and the debate over that was enough to heat up a hearing during and after. The Tuesday evening House Corporations Committee hearing on the hair braiding bill co-sponsored by Anastasia Williams included about a half dozen witnesses testifying for and against the measure. Jackie Pace, a licensed cosmetology instructor, testified against and was back at the State House Thursday for a Senate hearing on the bill. Pace says after the hair braiding portion of the hearing, Williams left the lawmakers table, walked to the back of the room and made what she called an intimidating and bullying hand gesture to at least two people. She just kind of made the motion like this. It's done. The bill's done. Pace is one of four who told Target 12 Williams made contact with one woman. It was pretty much like an aggressive poke, you know, that she had done to her. I don't feel she has the right to intimidate people that way. Williams has not responded to requests to comment on camera, but did deny she made the hand across the throat motion or made contact with anyone. In an email on Tuesday, Williams told us had that happened, I would have been carried out of the state house to jail or at the minimum, police would have been called, not the media. A spokesman for House Speaker Nicholas Mattiello says Mattiello has spoken with the woman who claims Williams made contact with her. But at this point, there is no word whether or not anyone will be reprimanded over the heated exchange. We have spoken with a woman who claims Williams pushed her, but she did not want to comment on camera for this story. The braiding bill passed unanimously in the House last year, but never made it out of committee in the Senate. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.